next story is all about a very popular desert plant called a cactus. I don't like this thunder and lightning. It'll soon pass, Sam. And just think how good all this rain is for the plants. Really, Grandad? Of course rain is good. Without water, there'd be no plants, which would mean no food for us. Well, maybe rain isn't so bad, but I don't like the thunder. I know what will help pass the time. A tale about a very popular and unusual plant called a cactus. One day a family of woodpeckers were blown off course by a terrible storm and got lost in the desert. I'm hungry, Mummy. Oh, I'm thirsty. Huddle in tight. We'll find some food as soon as the storm is over. Once the storm had passed, the desert changed very quickly from wet and thundery to very, very hot and dry. Goodness me! What are you all doing here? I've never seen birds like you around here before. We're lost and looking for food and shelter. Best thing you can do is find a cactus. A cactus? I don't think I've seen one of those before. It's a green plant, and there'll be plenty of water inside it for your little ones. And so Mother Woodpecker set off across the hot, dry, dusty desert to find a green plant called a cactus. Excuse me, Lizard. I'm looking for a plant called a cactus. Oh, the cactus is very popular around here. It holds so much water and lots of insects live there, too. Hmm. I love insects and water. Why does a cactus have lots of water, Grandad? A cactus is like a big water tank. It soaks up lots and lots of water when it rains, and its waxy skin stops the water leaking out when it gets hot. So, where can we find a cactus? Keep traveling in that direction. You should find one amongst the other desert trees. Oh, and watch out. The cactus has spines. There! A cactus! It might be. Let's see if there's any water in it. There's no water. This can't be a cactus. There are no spines, either. Let's not give up. Come on. We're looking for a thick, green plant with waxy skin and prickles. There! I don't think that's a cactus, either. <gasps> but look behind it! Over there! Follow me! Now, mind where you land, little ones. Remember the spines. Oh, my. And look at these insects. <gasps> wow! Ouch! Ouch! What's that? It looks like a cactus doesn't want to be eaten by rats. A perfect nest! I wonder if we can eat this. It's a very good thing that the woodpeckers enjoy the fruit because it contains seeds. Why? Well, when they eat the fruit, they swallow the seeds and the seeds come out in the woodpecker's poo. When the poo lands on the floor, hopefully more cactuses will grow. The next time there was a desert storm, the woodpeckers were much safer. The hole that Mother Woodpecker found in the stem of the cactus gave them great shelter. And if you looked carefully on the floor, you could see a little baby cactus growing too. From the woodpecker's poo. <laughs> yes, Sam. What are you doing, Sam? I'm going to gather lots of rainwater so I can store it like a cactus. But you don't have prickles. How are you going to stop me getting to it? Hmm.